Hey, low life, you're such an idiot. He had nothing to do with Crown Heights, says his press release. I wasn't even there when the rioting broke out. The rioting took place over a three or four day period. Your, your sick, hateful speech was outrageous. Your Jew baiting was outrageous. You like to claim you're a leader of the black community. I guess people heard you. Otherwise, why did you say the things that you said? You didn't say them to your, yourself. You said it to 3,000 people at a funeral. Your inflammatory hate speech was certainly present. Well, I had nothing to do with Freddie's fashion, Mart. Oh, really? The guy that killed those people in there, he wasn't a friend of mine. Nobody said he was. More hateful speech, anti-Jewish, anti-Semitic speech. More white interloper, quote-unquote, speech. We've got the audio. Hannity plays it all the time. Maybe I ought to play it all. I'm going to bring a lawsuit, defamation against Rush. Anybody else? He apparently is very litigious. Because his rights are always being violated. Poor guy. I can just imagine what top litigators in this country could do to Al Sharpton in depositions and on the stand. I can just imagine how deeply they would dig. Here he's tried to remake himself from the street slob that he was into the king of uh, political kingmakers and... Uh, uh, into a civil rights leader. He's tried to mainstream himself, and here he is. He's going to bring it all back to the fore. The real Al Sharpton. What an idiot. What a fool. I am not a criminal. They said it. Did somebody call you a criminal? Why are you so defensive? Why are you so defensive? Oh, but I can just a mile imagine a full-blown trial involving Al, the various witnesses, because you see, Al, you'd be defending even though you're the plaintiff. You'd be explaining what you did over and over again in meticulous detail. You'd be explaining those vicious hate speech comments that you made against Jews and whites and, frankly, blacks who dared to cross you. Yes, and you'd have to do it under sworn testimony, under penalty of perjury. You'd be the plaintiff, but you'd be on defense the entire time. And then, of course, there's the legal standard, malicious intent. All over the Internet, one news outlet after another exposes you out one after another. There can be no malicious intent. You are a damn fool. But I'm not your lawyer. I'm just one of the people out here who detests you for what you've done, for what you've said, and for your hate speech. I wonder if this kind of hate speech that Al Sharpton was so good at over the years. I wonder if that's part of the hate crimes bill. Or is he allowed free reign to trash people because of their faith or their color? Is Al Sharpton allowed to do that? Is he covered by the hate crimes bill? Is his hate speech covered by the hate crimes bill? I'm just curious because, you know, we want to be very progressive and forward-looking in this.